I left Prague, didn't I? Why do they want to kill me now? After me.
bloody thing. Halt! What are you doing here? Cry for God's sake. You'll wake the whole monastery. Silence! For God's sake, I caught you in the middle of an assassination attempt. Assassination? What are you on about? Are you Lord Pekar, the one who was on the crusade? Well, yes. How do you know that? Because you've come to assassinate Conrad Kieser. Kieser? He's living here in the monastery? Well, yes. Right here in this house. What's your business here? It's all a terrible mistake. I have a long-standing arrangement with a custodian here, Sir Sebastian von Berg. I supply him with salt and spices. And I've come to realise how he's been cheating me repeatedly. The dispute's been running for a while and still has legs. So I wanted my money back, that's all. I've no quarrel with Conrad. All right. I suppose I'll have to take your word for it. But stop creeping around here at night and trying to break into the house. Conrad is scared half to death and I need him in his right mind. Very well. That does sound like Conrad. I'll think up some other plan. Jesus! Well, did you find anyone? I did. And? You needn't fear. I kept watch the whole night and nothing happened. A few folk passed by, but nobody dangerous. And what about Pekar? Are you saying he has no malicious intentions? None. He's just doing some trade with the custodian. That's what brought him to where you were. Well, if you're sure... But I'd still rather lie low for a while. Come to Talmberg. You'll be surrounded by a whole garrison there. Yes. Yes, I suppose that does make sense. Uh, thank you, Henry. I'm in your debt. We'll meet at Talmberg. Be a bit more careful.
A well-chosen sight. You want to strike the gate, do you? True. We don't want to do more damage than necessary. I quite understand. Sir Toth is holed up there, is he? Just so, Master Conrad. I hear you have some accounts to settle with him. Ah, not entirely. I've done with him. Sigismund trusted him more than me in his campaign against the Ottomans, and we all know how that ended up. Uh, how did it end up? Badly, my lord. The flower of French knighthood was slain there. Sigismund fled for his life, and I did too, I must confess. Be assured we shall not make the same mistake here. We do not intend to starve them into submission, but to break down the gate. I am at your service, my lords. We will build the trebuchet quickly. It will be ready in a matter of days. And I can supply, for example, Roquetta to sweep the foe from the battlements. Roquetta? I do not believe I've heard of such a term. Roquetta are missiles filled with black powder with a touch hole at the bottom to ignite it. They shoot forward, something like a hand cannon, but without rocks. The rocket is the missile. I see. But we don't have black powder in these parts. Nor cannon. Indeed. It should have occurred to me. But I am very fond of Roquetta, and I always think what Alexander the Great might have accomplished with them. I understand. We find ourselves in a conventional situation that demands a conventional solution. I'm still hoping that Toth will see sense and parley with us. He may well do so, especially when we set the trebuchet on his doorstep. Hey, Henry's... Be a bit more careful. The Lord be praised. What brings you to me? I came to an agreement with Comrade. He's already here. You wouldn't believe how clever that fellow is. Now we really will build that trebuchet. That I guarantee you. You're in the wrong place in the wrong Just one thing. If he should send you somewhere and tell you to give some password about a fox or some such, well, you should take it with a grain of salt. Password? Fox? Uh, all right. I'll bear it in mind. Glad I could be of service. I'm truly grateful to you. Fine work. I probably shouldn't, but... Go and have a look in my trunk. You might find something there you can use. Thank you. Master Fafar, how's the trebuchet construction going? Much better now that I have Master Kieser to help me. Although, to be quite honest, it's more a case of me helping him. I'm taking note and learning as I go. Next time round, you'll be the siege master. I rather hope they won't be here next time. How's work going with Master Kieser? Excellent. His knowledge of machinery and mechanics is absolutely astonishing. He's a very gifted man. So you're confident the trebuchet will do its job? Absolutely. Hey, it's plain to see Master Kieser knows exactly what he's doing. Two arms! Get over here! Over here! Where is everyone? <laughs> What is it? Greetings. 
How much longer do you... I wouldn't like to hazard a guess. As I understand it, the base is quick to make, but the other parts are more complicated. And then there's all the balancing and setting the trajectory and range. I see. Well, I hope it's ready soon. So do I, Henry. Henry I'm glad you came. Jesus, look where you're going. My respects to you. How are we doing with the food? Who wants to know? One of their lordships? No, no. I just wondered if there was anything you're short of. Oh, I see. The lordling is wondering if we're in urgent need of anything. Well, well. To tell the truth, we don't have much meat. They bring it round often enough, but never as much as they should. Yes, I've heard something like that. <laughs> I'll say. Every other man's moaning on about it. The gamekeepers are doing all they can, but they can't keep up. So if you know how to help them out, bring it right here. I'll take care of the rest. Fine. I'll keep... Do we have any beer? Christ, I wish we did. Our ale's all gone, and we've drained the local inn dry. <sighs> That's bad news. Don't I know it. You can't go and catch a beer in the woods, either. But if you happen to know about some, let's hear it. News like that, it refreshed me almost as much as a drink. And the lads, too. God save you, Henry. God be with you, lad. How are you, my lord? How do you think? That slimy toad has my blood boiling. If I get my hands on him, I'll rip his black heart out. Only I've been handed the job of guarding the western route, and the quarry. But there's not a damn thing happening there. Well, at least you're out of archery range of the castle. True. But it's not much consolation. If the men don't get something to do soon, I'll have to put them to work in the quarry. Idle hands are the devil's tools. Good day, Henry. How do you think the siege will go, sir? Better than it has done so far, I hope. First, we lost your lord and father. God be with and then you, our Henry. nighttime assault failed. I'm sorry we didn't succeed. It would all have been over by now. But at least we got out alive. If the two of you had been left behind, Istvan would have had another pair of hostages. Oh, let's pray our fortunes improve. But I'm a bit worried about that trebuchet. I don't have much experience with engines of war. Even if we do drive Toth out, there might not be much left of the castle after we've done it. God be with you, Henry. Sir Hanush, do you think Sir Radzik is all right? Oh, don't worry. He's more used to Toth alive, so he's in no danger for now. For now? Radzig's a man who knows how to take care of himself. I'm more concerned about Lady Stephanie. It would be dreadful if anything happened to her. What do you think of Master Keezer? Uh, he's a foreigner, and quite possibly a madman. Did you hear him talking about those pipes filled with black powder? He knows how to build a trebuchet, though. Well, at least it looks like he knows what he's doing. I'm just glad there's no black powder in these parts. 
Given half a chance, he'd blow us all to pieces. It was a pleasure to talk to you, sir. Like what? stopping you and how's that gonna help do you think it's going to magically conjure up a pig I'm just saying that we've hardly begun I'm glad to see you. What do you think of Master Keezer? He definitely knows what he's doing. And all that wild talk of his... rockets and such like. I'd almost let him try it out, but on some other castle. Do you think there's any truth in it? I've never seen such weapons used, so I can't really judge. But if his ideas worked, they'd change the way we make war. He showed me some of the drawings he has with him. I don't know if he's a genius or a madman. Is there a... <sighs> the truth... Pity they didn't... Toth is a... Henry, I'm glad you came. God be with you, Henry. I'm glad you... God save you. What is your... Sir Hanush thinks he's insane. 
This craze is one of those dung-smeared fools reciting the New Testament backwards in the so bad thing. Master Kieser's seen and lived through a lot in his time in foreign lands. And those rockets he was talking See them. Shooting off. Screaming through the sky like comets. I'm sure... Állj, te kutya! Add meg magad, vagy... Már elég volt! My respects to you. I need to bring a few kegs of beer back to Tarnberg. To Tarnberg? Why? Actually, it doesn't matter. I don't care. I'm running low on beer and I've no kegs left. Ask again later, or go ask elsewhere. Have you got a bed? Aye. For how long? Just the one. Sure. Here you are. You all like it here. Where do I go? You'll have no trouble finding it. Right inside the door to...
I am honoured that a knight such as you takes an interest in me. Andrew, there's no more beer in Talmberg, and the soldiers are starting to grumble. Can't you send some there? I could, but there's nothing in it for me. Just as a matter of interest, who do you pay your taxes to? <laughs> You're saying I should be paying the Talmberg to old Sir Divish? <laughs> when Sir Havel of Valdeck was the master here, I managed to wriggle out of it. <laughs> Nobody's come collecting since. Well, right now, there are three noblemen camped by Talmberg, one of whom might be very interested to learn about all the tax you owe. I imagine he might want to collect it in the form of beer. Hmm. When you put it like if I kept them longer, and I'd have to throw them away. Just remember, if you poison them, they'll hang you for it. Though it's being eaten, it wouldn't occur to anyone the shits came courtesy of the beer. I'll have them loaded up right away. And Why the devil shouldn't I get some goodwill out of this at least? That as long as decent people can live in peace, <laughs> I can talk my way out Gets a man who fails to pay him a single groschen, and the poor... That's poor fault. I hope you'll drive him out of here so fast you'll shit him so... All to the good. A nice bit of manure and everything going on lately. Just some talk about lost sheep and... That's over and done with. They ran away into the forest. The wenches? The sheep now. But I did hear about something. Uh, something interesting. But it was about as old as you. He said his family owned the scallops all back home. See the damage and so on. And someone looted it right... It's not that interesting, just sad, really. Well, it certainly isn't Christian. But the thing is, they were hiding money in that cellar of theirs. It won't be easy to find him. Rat eyes a little overcrowded nowadays. Then you'll have to ask someone, won't you? Bloody hell. Do you want me to hold your hand while you do it? I'll be on my way then. Are you after? I've run out of boar meat. If you could bring. Good day, Henry. My God, what happened to you? I'm looking for some pitch for Talmberg. Already? What happened to the last lot we supplied? I don't know, and it doesn't matter. Do you have any, or don't you? I do. I had a buyer lined up, but it's been a while since he showed his face. What do you need it for? Talmberg's been taken by a horde of brigands, so we're laying siege to it. 
We could use some pitch. Christ's blood. I hadn't heard the news. All right, it's all yours. You gave us a hand with that ginger when we needed it, and if it's for Sir Divish, I know my duty. If you want to haul it away yourself, feel free, or I can get someone to deliver it to you. Thank you. God bless you. Good day, Henry. God be with you, lad. What can I do for you? How do you feel, Sir Divish? How's the shoulder? I felt better, boy. Ugh. I feel awful, truth be told. And my shoulder's paining me. Let someone tend to the wound and you'll soon be better. The flesh can be healed, perhaps, but the spirit... Henry, can you do something for me? What is it you need, sir? I need a priest as well as a physician. The closest was in Rovna, but I don't know what happened to him. And then there's the one from Ujits. What's his name? Godwin. But why would you need a priest? The wound will heal, especially with the help of one of the monks. It's not about me. I've got a lot of wounded here that won't see mourning, and dead men, and I have to confess my sins. How do you like Master Kieser, Sir Divis? How do I like him? As if it's not enough to hurl giant boulders at my castle, he wants to throw kegs of gunpowder. I understand, but he has to do something. Those boulders could hit my wife, and if they don't get her, the gunpowder could burn her to death along with Sir Radzik. Yeah, I know. I'm sorry. I know how you feel. I feel much the same. When we're done, what state will my castle be in? What will I do if the worst happens? What... Ah, enough of that. Better to spend my time in prayer than worry. 